All right. Hey, everyone. <laughs> Sorry, again, I haven't been streaming for the last week or so. We've been having some internet issues. I think they've been resolved now. I, I hope I can get back to a regular schedule of this, because um, every time there's a setback, it kind of resets my streaming mindset. So, like... <laughs> I just feel like I'm stuttering my stuttering mess again and I don't want that every time I'm streaming <laughs> so fingers crossed I can get back to a regular schedule we'll see how things go though anyway um yeah might as well just get into the game I don't really have much else to really talk about at the moment yeah let's get into it All right. I played this game when it first came out like five years ago, I think. I haven't really picked it up much since. So it should be fun. Alright. So, obviously, we want to start a new game. Uh, what settings do we have? Yeah, everything seems fine here. Hope the uh, the game audio is okay. Inspired by Saban's power. I I wish they didn't have to do that, but um, Saban's gonna Saban. Even though Hasbro owns the property now, that disclaimer at the bottom still stays. Uh, let's see. You're used to playing RPGs, but don't want to think. Too hard. Mm. Let's go with challenging mode. I think I played on interesting before, so yeah. I'll go with challenging for this one. Alright. Of course we get the usual sort of tutorial stuff. Once upon a time, in a TV studio, just like any other. Okay. <laughs> Super Rangers! It is time for stuntmen to get in the scene! <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah. I think that's what I mean. I'm just, like, I'm not feeling it at the moment. I need to. Mm. I need to get back into a proper routine. Okay. Hurry up! And there they are. Our heroes, I guess. And where are the minions? I don't know why I'm giving them the Paul Heyman voice, but... It kind of fits. Uh, what do they call these things again? Are they, like, parties? There we go! We're all set for this part. Effects will come later! I guess we're lacking some story, huh? Yeah, but Mr. Soap doesn't enjoy it that much. <laughs> Mr. Soap. I'm I'm pretty sure that was actually supposed to be a parody of Saban before the whole, like, we're going to shut you down unless you, uh... <laughs> unless you mention that you're inspired by us kind of thing. This is getting really boring. I'm kind of tired of... Stop talking while we're recording! God. Battle them, or should I remind you that you may select a spot to either walk or choose a monster you want to attack? God. Defeat three enemies. Okay, straightforward enough. So we'll move yellow over here. Uh, black over here. Um, hmm. I select these. Oh, I can, but nobody can get near them. Okay. Uh, suppose if I move pink here. Oh. Um. Okay. I um, think I remember how to do this now. Uh. Oh. You can move them twice, okay. Yeah, I can. God. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two. Okay, so yeah, if I just move you forward one, and oh, um, yeah, I guess you don't get much of a choice then. Uh, oh wait, extra teamwork is that? Ah, there we go. I'm remembering stuff. <laughs> move you here. Teamwork. And then the enemies are going to move. Hee hee. Hee hee. Alright, now we just need to kill one more enemy. Done. Oh wait, I guess the scene's still going. A weird objective. Didn't they just tell me to beat all the enemies? There we go. Beat three enemies. Plus. This is one of the best episodes I've seen so far in the season. He always says that as long as we're defeating the monsters really easily. I heard you! Now I want some acrobatics! We can add some explosions to them later. What kind of... Let me finish talking! Jeez. You should use the teamwork maneuver to toss people around so they can move further. If you still don't get a word of... A word I said... Fucking hell. Use teamwork and then select those yellow cells. Get in position! Okay, we're ready. Alright, here come the more putties. Ready to. Alright, perform two acrobatic moves. Right. So, just use teamwork on yellow here. Uh, have black target this one. Perfect. Hmm. Use teamwork on red. And then have blue target you. And then pink targets this one. Oh, still one left. Okay. I can sort that out on the next turn. you here and use the teamwork. Move you there. And then red attacks the last one. Alright. Nice. Cut! And another perfect scene! Be glad I'm here to tell you what to do all the time! Oh boy. Now show the audience some more teamwork! You know how it works. Attack a minion when someone is using teamwork next to it. I trust you guys won't hurt me. Oh. Oh, how wrong you are. Okay. So move up to you. Use teamwork. Attack with both black and yellow together. And then we can just kill this one. Oh. Or maybe not. Okay. Right. Move blue over here. Teamwork. And now can I kill you? Double attack. Nice. Form a team attack with two squad members. Great job! Keep it like that. I'm loving this. Move now so the boss can teleport into the set. Where's the big girl in the monster suit? This is how you gotta do this! Remember your training! Put four of you adjacent to the monster in teamwork, and then attack the monster! Everyone around will help you out! God. This is what we call a finishing move! So in other words, a FINAL WEAVE! 
God. I can't. I can't. Why is he saying all these things again? We've done this so many times already. He just likes telling people what to do, I guess. A monster will blow up when you do the finishing move! I need the five of you to do it together! Shouldn't we fight the monster before the finishing move? This feels rushed. Our audience won't enjoy it. I never want to hear you say, I want it that way! God. <laughs> Defeat the boss monster with a finishing move. Okay, so we need to move these guys around the monster. Teamwork. Uh, move you here. Teamwork. Let's leave the red to last. Uh, blue over here. Teamwork. Pink on this side. Teamwork and... Move red in for the attack. Chroma power! Defeat the boss with a finishing move. You are so strong! Splendid! Now for the grand finale! The huge monster explosion! No. Oh wow. This is ridiculous and not even a giant robot fight. Hey! God. The actors just sit in the chairs. We stuntmen do most of the recording. And besides, this is so silly, we always record in the studio. We should go outside, see different places. Come on, people! Our show is not that bad! I'm listening! Why can't we run our own, our very own studio? Oh my, that... That's just a perfect idea! Count me in. What? Are you leaving Super Rangers? I'm in too, let's do this. Have fun leading a studio that isn't fun to work at, Miss Dr. Soap. Bye bye, Dr. Soap. Oh, and please stop being so mean to your employees. You can't! <laughs> at least leave the suits at the door! The stuntmen meet a moment later, still dressed in their old studio spandex suits. Oh my. They talked about how they could start their own studio and record their first episode. After a few minutes, an idea popped up. My uncle has a warehouse not far from here. We should use it. Alright, that could be a start. It might be just what we need. I haven't given these characters a voice yet because, uh, you know, obviously you get to pick your uh, your characters later on. Or in just a little while, actually. Let's go there now. Oh, hey, is that giant robot a reference to something? I swear it looks familiar. Arriving at the warehouse, everyone got very excited because of its size. <laughs> That's what she said. And how they could take advantage of all that available bleh, and how they could take advantage of all that available space. They were looking around and thinking about camera positions. When someone spotted something. A huge pillar at the very center of the warehouse, covered in some sort of dirty bedsheet. No one knew what was under it. Where are those stunt actors? Oh, there they are! They need to return my studio spandex suits! But wait, what is that? I'll just keep watching. Then, curiosity knocked at someone's door and the sheet was removed. Oh my god, a giant brain! Amazing! An incredible replica of a device used in an American TV show series. Harry... He, fucking... I can't read. <laughs> I 
I can't voice and I can't read. Amazing. An incredible replica of a device used in an American hero TV series. Someone plugged in the energy cable, and the machine said its welcome message out loud. Hello, my name is Cerebro. This is an example message. Type the words in my back display, and I shall text to speech them. Everyone's eyes shined. Wow, let them have those suits. I know what I actually want from them now. I'll think of some devious plan. I'm out. God. We were just looking for a place to set up our studio and record, but... Now we also have this Cerebro thing to support our story. It's amazing. Yes, this is it. Just ask your uncle for this too. Our future fans will love it. Will do. I think he'll be happy to lend us anything, including the warehouse. Hooray! Everyone gather your props at home and le let's meet up tomorrow. <laughs> we have plenty of work to do. So the group of friends decided to take their different path in their lives. Take a different- the fuck. I can't. <laughs> So the group of friends decided to take a different path in their lives. Later that day, the clothes were returned to their old boss. And after a few weeks, with a contract ready to be signed, they finally have everything ready to start recording. Woo! New show. Reaper's loving it. Look at them vibe. New contract conditions, record season finale, after recording four other episodes, the contract will be cancelled if the number of fans is lower than zero. Eh, that shouldn't be too difficult. Alright. What do I want to name my company? I guess I'll just play it safe and go with uh, Gurido. Burrito. Confirm. Alright, now here is where we get to choose the actors, I think. So let me just have a quick scan through these. I have some ideas for stuff I would want to have. But let's just see. Uh... Well, I mean, he looks the most like me. <laughs> If I were to make a character based on myself. Oh wow, a robot? It was bound by only two of Asimov's laws. Uh, I see. Ryo Yoshi. Elamelia? Okay. Well, this guy has um, this guy has a bandana, so he's definitely in the running <laughs> so far. I'd say my lackadaisic Cafro disease is more of a character trait than my uh, than my obesity. <laughs> so yeah, this guy seems to be best choice for me so far. Alien, okay. Von Andy. Oh god, another <laughs> another fat nerd. Uh, again, the uh, the other one I saw, Mr. Beaver. <laughs> nice. Okay, so yeah, I think I know what I want to do for myself. I'm gonna use this guy. Let's call him Rob. And we'll make your suit purple. Because purple is my favourite colour. Okay, uh, so... Techie next. I don't want to see which of the uh, which of the other four I have in mind is better equipped for... You know, the... 
fuck, I can't. <laughs> Which ones are better equipped for uh, for their roles, I guess? Let's see, uh, skill regen. Out of space. I mean, I don't suppose it matters too much. Um, let's see. Oh, plus 10 item drop rate. That's not bad. Uh, I guess it'll make sense for the robot to be the techie, so... Yeah, let's make you the techie. Uh, call you... Omega? I think I'll make you red. Alright, an assist. Let's see. Plus 20 skill regen heals when using teamwork. Hmm, alright. Ooh. Maybe I won't go with the alien for this? Uh, alien name starts with D. I think. D, 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 D. Just call him Dave. Yeah, I'll call him Dave. Uh, what colour? I, I feel like it would be kind of racist if I made him green, so uh, maybe give him a different colour scheme instead. Uh, what about yellow? You like yellow? I mean, it kind of goes with your eyes, so yeah, why not? Okay. Assault. I think I know what I want to do with you. Uh, I feel like we kind of need one normal character in this <laughs> in this team, so let's have the action hero guy be our assault character, and we'll call you Kevin. make you blue. There we are. That looks nice. And then final character, the scout. Oh god. Final character, the scout. Give you Mr. Beaver. And... Did I say beavers before? I kind of wanted a character with a with an S for a name, so let's go Svib. There we go. Dave, Omega, Rob, Kevin, Svib. We are the Dorks. Oh, let's uh, let's make you green. There we are. I think we're all set. Confirm. You're about to confirm your squad setup. There is no turning back for the save game. Okay, do uh, Okay, do <laughs> What am I saying? What am I doing? God. Speak slowly and precisely. I can't understand you. Yes, Chester. Sorry, Chester. Okay. No turning back for the saved game. Cool. That's fine. Your game has been saved. Oh wait, were there were there other things I needed to do as well? Um let's see, stats, no. I could have sworn there were other things I can, can do for this. Uh, oh yeah, here it is. Right. Squad name. Obviously, I said it already. We are 
dorks. Transform, chromatize, um, nerd up. Everybody say, <laughs> when you hear the call, you got to get it. I'm no way nerd up. Right now, I've got Jonathan Davis on a chihuahua with, with a <laughs> Jonathan Davis face. On a chihuahua stuck in my head. Hmm. Let's see. <laughs> the mecha shout. Imagination! Obviously a reference to Tokuja, which I never got around to finishing. Uh, let's keep it simple. Nerd up with... Exclamation. Uh, mecha name. I, I don't know. Finishing move. Taste the pain bow. <laughs> God. Face the pain bow. <laughs> but I'm such a dork. Mecha name. Uh... Dorkatron? I'm going to keep imagination in there. Imagination! Right, there we go. I've got mail. How do I check my emails again? Oh yeah, Y button. Let's see. Hello, hello, how are you doing? My name is Hermes Barreto. I am a master of crafting props for movies and TV. Some of my wares even have special bonuses. Make sure to visit my shop. Have fun. Okay. Uh, I think we'll... Oh, actually... I am playing on challenging mode, so maybe getting some decent equipment from the get-go might be a good idea. So this is already, like, by default better than what we have. Uh, skill region, skill... 45 plus health, 40 plus health. Uh, hmm. Well, the, uh... The gloves are a no-brainer, at least. And the boots. Let's buy a set of boots for everyone. Yeah. Okay, and... Set of gloves for everyone. Oh god. Uh, fuck. <laughs> Alright, buy and equip. Buy and equip. Buy and equip. I equip. Uh, we still have enough for a, some new suits each. Hmm. I think those who have. Let's see. What is everyone's health? I would say. 
give this guy the comfy suit. Yeah, me a comfy suit. Maybe give you the padded suit. Mm, hmm. Yeah, padded for you. Kind of want to go padded for you as well. Uh, comfy for me for the bulk. Uh, let's see. Padded for you and padded for you as well. And I think that'll do. You can get rid of all my weapons later on. Just kind of pissed off that I, <laughs> that I bought one suit more than I needed because I'm an idiot. Maybe I can. Can I do something with that? I don't think I have the uh, the crafting stuff available just yet, so. Yeah. Uh, let's just go on to the first episode. It, It's a box. Pilot episode for your very own series. Today, Garido will deal with a new threat that appeared near a science lab. Oh my god, a box. Warehouse of Omega's uncle. Robots can have uncles? Season 1, Episode 1. Such a weird team. Wow, our first episode! That's awesome! What if that first story was about a group of monsters that tried to rob a science lab? And then I beat up dozens of them. Yeah, great, but hold on. We should add a narrator. Don't start the action yet. Once upon a time, a group of heroes is born. Uh, I'm trying to think of a voice I can give this guy. What do you think, Rob? I heard that a good plot starts like that. I don't know what that voice is maybe. Maybe I could just give him the Ed voice. That's good, but it's spelled wrong, isn't it? Once up to- oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> Once up time. Oh, the guy who sold us the narrator software told me it's one of its quirks. We should roll- we should just roll with it. These powerful teenagers are the last hope of humanity. And their first task is to defend a science lab from an evil monster. Hmm. But aren't the minions kind of late? Where'd they go, Sveeb? I don't know, Rob. They should hurry. What do you say, Dave? They must be getting dressed. Don't worry. Let's just have fun with our new job. Smile. Alright, here they come. We'll have lots of editing to do later, Omega. Action! Noisy noises. Squirrel! Hey, you all! Get ready for some action! Form 3, Team Acrobatics. Keep all actors above 50% health. Cool, okay. Alright, I think just have Sveeb move here. Teamwork. We need to do acrobatics three times. That's good to me. Look. Alright. Oh, I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even do a leap, okay. Uh, let's move Omega over here. Teamwork. Hmm. Alright. Hmm. Move you back here. <laughs> Fuck's sake. It's been so long since I've played this game properly. Ugh. Alright, 
Alright, so we've done free acrobatics. Oh, we can nerd up. Here we go. Nerd up, everybody say. When you hear the call, you've got to get it on the way. Nerd up. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, where do I want you to go? Let's set up a teamwork attack here. And then have you attack. Double attack! Alright, I'll move here. Teamwork. And double team with Omega. Nice. Uh, just say, have Dave back up a bit. There we go. Probably could have used some skills. Didn't think, because I'm an idiot. I wasn't concentrating, and I paid for that. Hopefully, I won't have to use that, that sound bite too much. I will fight until the end. Uh, can we have Dave? No, no, Dave won't have enough to beat that minion. Let's move him over. Activate teamwork. Okay, Kevin can beat this one. There we go. And we'll take on this one. Double whammy. <laughs> Nerf, please! Uh, I'll move Omega over here. Teamwork. Hmm. Kill this one. This is gonna hurt! <laughs> Wow. God. Kevin! Oh no, I failed. <laughs> I failed an objective. Shit. I wasn't concentrating, and I paid for that. Oh uh, no. Oh, wait, surely I could use uh, Dave's skill to get him back up to 50? Let's see. Uh, skills. Yulduken. Use it on Kevin. Yildoken! <laughs> oh, that doesn't... That doesn't help anyway. Once it gets below that... Uh, fucking hell. Okay. Just finish this last guy off. God. Failed the first mission, how? After defeating the powerful aliens, while the squad was planning what to do next, something devious appears. Ah, it's the VLC icon. That's an amazing entrance, trans Transit Man, sir. This this will be great. Keep it up. Dorks, why did you have to mess up our visit to the science lab? You will face the consequences, but right now, I'll come for you- but not right now, I'll come for you later. <laughs> God. What were you doing in that lab? It's none of your business. Well, who was that traffic light guy and where did he go? Wait, Kevin, are you acting or are you really lost right now? Oh, come on, Zvib. I'm acting. Go on with the story. Er, uh, okay. Well, I don't know, Kevin, and I can't track it with my scanner. That monster may strike again any minute now. So Cerebro might have something to say. You're right, Dave. We should go see Cerebro. Dorks, heads to the Cerebro chambers. D Heads to Cerebro Shame. Oh, God. I can't. <laughs> I'm terrible tonight. I'm sorry. They reached a place with a glorious teleport effect. So majestic. 
Wow, Omega, I didn't expect you <laughs> could render that. Blah, 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 blah. Fucking hell. Wow, Omega, I didn't expect that you could render such a cool background with the chroma key. Me neither. This looks much better than the one I did. Better for us, huh? After everyone explains the situation to Cerebro. Why do they want that research data so badly, Cerebro? They believe it is the key for them to unlock the power of time travel. This is not a power that anyone could have. Now return to your previous location. I am detecting a new threat. It's impressive to see the Cerebro device working. Dorks heads back. The teleport effect is not ready yet. To the scene running. Glorious. Where are the monsters? Can't wait to use my special poses. It, it's a box. I'm late. How deep we into this episode? Deep enough. You are so late, boxing box. It won't happen. This won't happen again. I'm sorry. Back to our lines, then. I will turn you into cardboard. Don't get me wrong, Kevin, but I'm cardboard. Minions, join me. Ready to serve, boss. Watch out. Alright, defeat the boss monster with a finishing move, defeat all minions before attacking the boss monster. Okay. Seems straightforward enough. Let's hope I don't mess it up this time. Alright. Teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork. Ooh. Uh huh. Oh, teamwork for you, and then. Ooh, will this work? Oh, they do a double team after the acrobatics. That's cool. Keep everyone bundled together so you don't. Just gang up on one guy. Okay, squad's turn. Super- what the hell? You could do that? Oh god. Great, right, and now- now Dave's stunned. He can't move. Oh wait. Can he move? Oh, there we go. Let's have you on teamwork. Hmm. Have Dave do teamwork and these two double team on this one. Uh, let's move down here. There we go. Probably gonna get hit again. Too fast for you. <laughs> you were saying, Omega? Alright, so that box isn't going to attack me suddenly at the start of my turn again, is it? Uh, Dave looks like he's doing right now, but maybe hold off on using him for now. Have these guys finish up the minions. Uh, teamwork on you. Double whammy, you're on! Teamwork, and finish this one off. Nice. Now we should be all set for... ...taking on the box. Right, so surround him. Get ready for the... ...special attack. 
fact. I have everyone else around him first. Here we go. And now it's time for Boxing Box to taste the rainbow. Oh, wait. Maybe not. Uh. Shit, I can't. <laughs> okay, uh, what skills can I use? That doesn't work. Oh. Maybe this? Eagle Lasso. Okay. And then. Yeah, I'll we'll just do one of these. Not gonna be enough to get the. to get him in finisher range, but. hopefully, in the next turn. Alright. We'll just get everyone else into position. We're gonna make it over here. Teamwork. And then these two chip away a bit more health. Nice. Yeah, let's get me back into, into range. Teamwork. In fact, let's do a triple team move this time around. Yeah, not knock him down. That should be in range to finish him next turn. Triple attack! Okay, so now we can finish him. Provided no one gets stunned this turn. Okay. Teamwork. Teamwork. And now, it's time to taste the pain, motherfucker! Taste the pain bow! Nice. Arg! I have been recycled! But what about that trans... The, the What about that transit master? Transit Mancer, fucking fuck. But what about that Transit Master? <laughs> Why do I keep wanting to say Master? Mancer. Transit Mancer is in a fucking magician. Transit Mancer. Monsters always come back when they fail on their first try. It will show up soon enough, Sveeb. And when it comes back, we'll be there to stop it. To be continued. Well done everyone, this episode should make quite a splash in the community. Oh hey, we got some crafting materials. Duct tape, cotton, and play-doh. <laughs> great. Oh. Dorks is really great. Check out Dorks. Greedo's series is amazing. I wish I could do a finishing move like that in my karate class today. <laughs> Brownie face. Hashtag new series, hashtag dorks, hashtag so rad, hashtag love it, hashtag hashtag. Okay, so good start. Ah, there we go. There's the crafting I was worried about. Alright, got mail. Hey, do not delete, okay? Read, please. Uh, hey, this is kind of crazy, but hear me out, okay? I just want to warn you from very ta very trustful s sources uh, that we are 92% sure that the monsters you are fighting are real. They have to believe us. You, hey, you have to believe us. You must write an episode where evil is completely and utterly defeated. Hey, I know it sounds crazy. Hey, but it's true. Also, from less trustworthy sources, I'm the only one who believes there's 52% chance that you are also part of the simulation, virtual reality, hey, some sort of video game, you know. Hey, just in case, do not pull any power cables, it may turn everything off and we disappear, just keep everything hey. <laughs> there's a 52 chance! <laughs> I kind of want to play the, <laughs> the Scott Steiner thing, but no, no. Uh, calm down, it's just a TV show. 
What the? What? Delivery to the following recipient failed permanently. What? Uh, okay then. Well. Right. Now uh, let's see, crafting. Uh, oh yeah, we can uh, recycle some of the stuff we didn't use. So, let's recycle these. <laughs> and that one suit I never used because I bought one too many. Try not to take too long on this. What I'm thinking I'll do is probably play like one season per stream. But once I get to the end of season one, that'll probably be it for tonight. to make a lever, because that's totally how that works. <laughs> Silver tape, we made from duct tape. Hmm. With love, mum. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Uh, oh, we can craft weapons as well. Uh huh. No, I think I'll stick with what I've got for now. And then do all the customization stuff uh, in between seasons, maybe. Just try and keep things consistent throughout. Unless I'm struggling a lot, then in which case I will probably need to. Uh... Yeah. Alright, let's save and then go on to the next episode. In this episode, an innocent bystander will be kidnapped by the evil monsters. But should this victim be a boy or girl? Also, laundry problems. Okay. I see. I have been researching, and I think I know a way to go viral and boost our audience. What is it, Omega? Some of our episodes should be referencing the greatest heroes ever from other TV shows. Cool, we could record a special episode, but money isn't our best weapon. Don't worry, Rob. I've got something in mind. There will be a kidnapped girl, just like in the series that inspired us. And my sister will be kidnapped... will be this kidnapped girl. Wait, wait. Why are we not using a male in need of, a, of being rescued? This is a valid point, Dave. Shouldn't we do this with somebody else? She is family, and she always wanted to be rescued on a hero TV show. Well, I think we should be careful so we don't fall into any sexist tropes. If the series that inspired us... Ugh, God, fucking hell. If the sp ugh, the f if the series that inspired us... Why can't I do this? <laughs> if the series that inspired us was... Were like this, and if Steve's sister really wants to do it, what's the problem? I can't... I, for whatever reason, I can't do, <laughs> do the voice with that sentence. Kevin, we may not s see our motives as sexist or racist, or things like that. But when people watch our shows, they... They see only what is on the screen. <laughs> so it's our responsibility to change the way things are instead of just reproducing the world as it is. I understand now. Fun things can also change the world, right? Smiley face. And such a small change, too. My brother-in-law, Luciano Diaz, also wanted to be saved by us. So I guess my sister won't be disappointed after all. 
How does that make any sense? Okay, now let's do it. Let's move out, dorks. <laughs> Come on, dude. The hostage is still here. We need to take him to the boss. Let's do this. I think dorks will be here soon. There we are. Oops. Dorks must fight through dangerous enemies to save a boy's life. Hurry, he's right there. We must jump over the f that fence with... <laughs> Hurry, we must jump over that fence with Team Acrobatics. Oh, actually, I'm sorry to interrupt the episode, Rob, but... What now, Omega? Our uniforms are still at the laundry. We can't, we can't nerd up in this one. I hope our fans won't understand. I hope our fans understand. Let's abuse the use of our teamwork to make it more fun. God. All right, is everyone set? Let's do this. Hurry, he's right there. We need to set. Why can't I just use my martial arts skills to beat these monsters up? Luciano, what did I tell you earlier? <laughs> you need to... <coughs> oh, God. Ugh. You need to stay quiet. We don't even have a microphone on you. All right, all right. Impact phrase. Ready, let's go. Three, two, one, action. Hurry, he's right there. We need to save him. Not if we stop you first, dorks. Alright. Direct instructions. Reach the guy before defeating all enemies. Reach guy in three turns. Alright. So, hmm. I have speed move over here. Do teamwork. Weak Nutcracker, okay. Uh, yeah, let's try and get everyone up the board as far as we can. Reach them in three turns. would be too much of an issue. Double whammy, you're on. I guess we don't need to use acrobatics in order to get through here, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, let's just have Dave progress. Oh god. Turtle, that turtle really packs a punch. I can't do anything with you, so uh, move you over here. Teamwork, and oh, move myself up here. I'm gonna take out this one. Oh, uh, oh wait. Okay, I see what I've done wrong here. Uh, right. Teamwork. Double team you. Go. This hurts. It's just a costume wound. Alright. Okay. Oh. Uh. oh. Can I reach him now? Mm. Not quite. But maybe. Right, how far can speed go? Get up to there, so maybe if I put Omega... 
maybe to be on the safer side. Move Steve up here. Oh wait, here we go. Nice. Okay, so that objective is complete. So now... Finish off the baddies. Hang up on the Nutcracker here. Mega there. Teamwork on this one. Ah. Not quite enough. I won't give up. Oh wow. Nice counter by Dave there. Alright. Maybe if I keep speed there. Try to finish up all these nutcrackers before I do anything else. So Dave picks up this one. Yeah, we'll keep you there. Uh, move Kevin over here. No, please, dude. It's not going to finish them off. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I was wrong. Alright, uh... Yeah, Steve, you stay there. And we'll team up on this one. Teamwork. Omega. I think we can beat them with a triple. Let's do that. Triple attack! Nice. Didn't this happen in Moon Vulcan too? Only if we had recorded it at the North Pole's Veeb. Ha ha ha. Psst, spoilers! Yeah, that's th that's the very last episode. Ha ha, good one. Too bad we didn't have the Amazon girl to fight with. Good job, everyone, and thanks to Lu Luciano Diaz. Uh, what the, uh, I wish they'd used their finishing move. Yeah. I think it's actually cool to see the heroes fighting with their street clothes. So many good shows to watch now. Must add dorks to the pile. <laughs> Hashtag first world problems. Mate, I have... I've seen about Dorks fans. I have seen about Dorks fans are loving it around the world. <laughs> oh god, the fan number. Uh... 69 me done. 69 me save me. <sighs> god. All right. Oh, it saves after every uh, every finished episode anyway, so didn't have to worry about that. A proposal. Hello, card lovers. I'm the CEO of Knights and of pen and cardboard, inspired by sorceress of the East Coast dangers and cardboards. <laughs> As the world's number two secret society of cardboard box admirers, we are in awe of the masterful display of your dorks TV show. Would you be interested in becoming members of our cardboard cult? It's a lifetime fee of $32 and if you and you'll get a shipment of assorted cardboard flavours in your mailbox every three months for the next for the rest of your lives, may your boxes never wet. Knights of Pen and Cardboard. Uh, we're into plastic. Yeah. Oh, the blasphemy! Oh, the nerve! If you, if you like this nonsense, take it. We have no need for this filth here. Don't ever reply to this email. Lost three fans, but gained five plastic. Okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Let's see, can we craft some stuff? We need some tape. I don't think I ever got, like, upgraded helmets, so... Maybe that'll be an idea? Yeah, let's get some more material. Uh, 
know, five silver tape should be enough. We'll make some bucket helmets. Uh, plus ten attack, plus twelve health. Uh, give it to Kevin, I guess. Plus six dodge, plus five counter. Uh, which one's the scale? Yeah, I'll give it to Steve. Oh wait, that was gloves? Shit. <laughs> I really need to pay more attention to what I'm doing. Uh, plus 12 health, plus 7 counter. Hmm. Yeah, maybe, maybe give Steve that one as well. Plus 37 health. I guess with me being the bulkiest one out of us, um, that'll have to go to me. Alright, I think I have enough to make one more helmet, so got to make it count. Mm. Give this one to Omega. Oh, I can make one more helmet. And this one will have to go to Dave. I think that's everyone. I don't think I can buy it. Yeah, I need swords and guns. Uh, maybe I should give the rest of these guys some weapons as well. Kevin could use a sword. Scout, I imagine, would do well with a pistol, as would Omega and Dave. Alright, so what's next? Barrel and roll. Gerido has an argument with stunt actor who does not want to use a proper costume, but they have to record the episode anyway. <laughs> Great. Defeat boss monster with a finishing move, attack the boss monster with lead three times. Okay. Cool. Uh, why are you wearing a barrel instead of the, your costume, mister? Arrgh, I'm a high-value stunt actor, and your silly costumes are beneath me. Wait, what? We have a contract with for this episode. So get back to that dressing room and wear whatever costume is in there. We'll even let you use the teleport effect as long as you're properly dressed. We'll move to the set and start recording while you change. Oi, oi. Alright, let's move now. Patience is a virtue, isn't it? A few moments later. A few moments later. <laughs> Still not in our proper costume. We can't record like that, my friend. This, this is my costume. I am the Barrel Man, and I'll and I'm going to roll all over you. Oh God, there are pigeons. Okay, that's enough. We are going to roll. You're going to roll back where you came from. God, all my voices are starting to. Just don't roll over us, boss. Defeat boss monster with a finishing move. Attack the boss monster with the lead three times. Alright, so yeah, obviously we want to nerd up. Nerd up. Everybody say. 
when you hear that call, you got to get it on the way, nerd up. <laughs> Sorry, I have to. <laughs> Alright, teamwork. Can I move myself to- no, I can't do that. Okay. Um, move Kevin over here then. Alright, so I move about as far as there. So let's have Dave move over here. Teamwork. I move a little closer. Mm. Oh, the lasso effect. Eagle lasso! Now I can attack you once. Our fans give us power! Alright, teamwork. Not the pigeons. Do a barrel roll! God. Alright. Let's see, where can I move to? Alright, let's have Kevin do a teamwork. Can I get into range? Oh, I can. Nice. Alright, so that's the second attack. I could fight you all day! Feeb up here. Teamwork. Oh, really? Okay. Hopefully Dave can reach that far. Nice. Triple attack! God, I'm being shot at by pigeons. Do a barrel roll! God, I'm out of range again. Uh, really can't move very far. Alright, Dave. Over there. Oh. Okay, there we go. I can land my third hit. So that's one objective sorted. You over there, teamwork. Can Kevin really not move that far? Uh, all right. Now let's attack this weak nutcracker. Double attack. Ah. Oh. Not enough to get the kill. Oh god. Sveeb, no! Alright, let's finish up these minions before I do anything else. That one. Do that. Omega up here. Teamwork. And that one should die. There we go. Dodging. Barrel roll. Arg. Have Sveeb stay there. Huh. Can the lasso reach anyone? Oh, I can get the uh, the weak bread crumbler. <laughs> bread crumbler, rather. 
Eagle Lasso. Uh, I'll still move a couple of the other guys, so... Yeah, but I can beat this one easy anyway. There we go. And then everyone else, I guess, just get into position for, for the finisher. Barrel roll! Yeah, I think I can get everyone around them. I don't think there's... Yeah, there's plenty of spaces. Alright. Get everyone to the teamwork position. Oh, wait, hang on. Yeah, I need to wear them down a bit first. Let's just do a triple attack for now then. There we go. Yeah, now he's ready to be finished. But, oh, barrel spike. Oh no. Oh shit. Well. I'm not gonna reach the objective. Ugh. I'm gonna get the objective for that then, I guess. Okay. Let's just finish him. Quadruple attack. Uh, what? What? Really? Uh huh. Okay. No, please. Uh, I can't believe I messed that one up. Now that's an explosion. Hey, you, watch Dorks. Hyped by Dorks after reading a review of the last episode. Awesome. Hashtag want more. Another perfect episode. Hashtag Dorks. Hashtag Superfan. Hashtag love you guys. And again. <laughs> fucking hell. 69 me, Don! 69 me, save me! I swear they're doing that on purpose. Oh, we got three emails this time. Uh, having fun, kids? What a forgetful uncle you have, Omega. We haven't talked since the studio's opening. How are things at my warehouse? Hope you have all the space you need. I told Joe to go fix that leak in the bathroom next Friday. I'll make sure to feed that cute little cat that lives around the place. He has been there since I bought the Cerebro device last summer. Probably stuck into the box or something like that. Cats are always nice to have around. Hope the little fellow inspires you to create new things. Okay, that's cool. Marketing. Greetings, representative of Garrido. My name is Ronald S Sam Sampayo. I'm the manager at Mad Folks Marketing Agency LLC. We loved your first episodes and we're willing to work for you, making your show reach more and more people around the world. This is how our agency works. You pay us a fixed weekly cost and we work converting the audience of your episodes into fans and income. We guarantee you a 15% increase in your audience on every episode, so we have a deal. It's free for the first week. Uh... I mean... Yeah, might as well give it a go. Glad to do business with you, I'm sure you'll love our services and will enjoy our new audience levels. Keep on recording. An old friend, hmm. How are you doing, my old friends? We all know that I'm the only reason why your new show is any good. I know our last <laughs> that our last moments weren't so great, and we were in a bad situation because of the ideas you had stolen from me. Let's get straight to the deal. You have a few options here. One, I'll see you in court, or two, you pay me tributes for my ideas, or three, I'll be your new director. I hope you understand the situation. Everything will be all right. Uh, um, guess we'll go to the mill round. Uh, tributes, I guess. <laughs> Which is weird, because this is kind of what Saban did with this game. 
Like, this has nothing to do with Power Rangers other than the fact that, you know, Power Rangers is the same sort of, like, Super Sentai kind of format. Uh, yeah, I'll go with the Tributes thing. There we go. Alright then, friends will always be friends. Don't worry about that. We talk soon. Okay. Alright. Oh, marketing. Okay. Um, I craft new stuff. Oh yeah, I can recycle these. Oh, uh, oh, did I not give any of the guys their weapons? Oh, that'll explain why uh, nobody had anything. Uh, let's see. Equip. Now you've got your toy sword. What to give Kevin a toy sword? No, not not a gun. For sake. There we go. Sweep. Toy pistol. Why can I not equip? There we go. <laughs> Omega. Pistol and Dave pistol. Why do I have one pistol left? I buy free on accident. Oh, let's see. All right, next episode. That alien terrorizes the city, and Cerebro sends dorks to deal with this threat. But someone has a dentist appointment. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's just start. I love it when we use the teleport effect for no reason at all. It's just so much fun, isn't it, Kevin? Ha <laughs> ha! I almost forgot. Omega, you have a dentist appointment today, right? Yeah, in a few moments, Rob. Then I'll have to leave. I'm sorry. Who knew robots had teeth? No problem. We'll make this quick as, as quick as possible. Get ready. It's time for the minions to get on stage. Rawr! Rawr! Suddenly, a very human-like alien-esque figure joins the scene. No, you are not supposed to join us right now. We haven't found our hiding place yet. Oh, I'm sorry, folks. I'll pay more attention next time. <laughs> God. A few more minions to the scene should make up for it. Prepare yourselves! We need to get rid of these monsters! They're all around us! Don't worry, Sphib! This should be easy! Go, dorks! Go! Former team attack with three squad members. Defeat all weak breadcrumbers within four turns. Okay, so we should probably concentrate on the pigeons. Do that. We can't nerd up yet, apparently. Uh... Yeah, I'll move Kevin up here. Ah, okay. Right. Omega, finish this. Okay. Nice. And... Uh, we'll have Dave and Kevin take this one out. Oh. Okay, then. <laughs> Not much for that idea, then. God, he ganged up on here. Oh, 
Oh my god. Getting surrounded by every <laughs> at every angle. Right, um. Still can't transform yet, okay. Alright, Seab, you up here. What, really? Can we not? Oh, we can transform now. Uh, yeah, maybe let's do that then. The dup. Teamwork. Hmm. Up here, teamwork, and then. Ooh. Just about beat this thing with a double T, I think. Alright. One more hit. Wait. Defeat four breadcrumbs. There's only three on the board. So, how? Unless another one pops up later on. Right. You've crumbled your last bread. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Fuck's sake, what, what is wrong with me? Right, so I think I need to beat it on this turn. Hopefully I don't lose all my teammates. <laughs> Looking bad. Oh. That was a good dodge, right? Oh man, uh, <laughs> poor Kevin back here. He's doing his best. All right, let's finish this bread crumbler off. Ah, oh, joking. Alright, let's use a skill. Multi shot. Oh, that that was probably not the best idea. Uh, let's use the gun. Oh wow. That actually worked. Oh no! Lost 50 audience because of the actors. Be a damn it. No. Not like this. Perform a team attack with three squad members. We, I guess we should probably do that now. Right. Triple team! And then, hmm. Bit easy, but why not? <laughs> Looks like. Oh, God. 
A bit dodging Dave. Uh, Alright. Speed over here. Teamwork on you. Oh, what? Why? How much did that say that would do? Uh, weapon damage 84 to 97. That should kill, I think. Let's try. Oh, oh, what? Um, ha. Huh. Okay. Hit. Alright. Make sure I use the gun this time then. We go. It's just a costume wound. <laughs> no, not Dave. Fourteen to one two seven. Oh, if it was a lucky. If I got lucky, that would probably kill him. So uh, let's give it a shot anyway. Ah, not quite. But probably finish him off with Omega. Sorry, friends. Oh no, what is happening? Sweet, it's just you and me. We need to do this. Double attack! Come on, we can survive this. Alright, come on. We're dodging. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No! Guys. Alright. One more minion left to kill. God, I've only got 3% health left. Need to get really lucky here then. Oh. Oh, please don't die, please don't die. Oh. Our fans are not happy. The episode got delayed one with Oh. Oh, shit. I think that's the first time I've ever gotten a game over on this. Well, not a game over, but, you know. Uh, hmm. Right, so maybe try and keep everyone together, perhaps, for the first bit. Based... Hmm. What to do, what to do. Maybe move Sviv up here. 
Beamwork. Uh, we'll have Kevin over here. Have these two double team on one of these. I'm in a slightly better position than I was last time. Right, this one I can kill quite easily. Here we are, and let's nerd up. Nerd up! Everybody say, when you hear the call, you got to get it out the way. Attack this one. Oh, bastard. Hmm. Hmm. Move this one over here. Teamwork, and then. Oh, here we go. Crumbler, 135. Double attack! Uh, well, I can kill it next turn, hopefully. one up here. There we be. Hmm. I don't think any of the others can reach this one down here. Let's see. Frustrating. Um, uh, what to do? What to do? Uh, okay, I'll move. Move Dave there. Oh, we can hit this one. I kind of want to keep them a bit separate, so... These guys will have to move around a bit more. Um, hopefully Kevin and Steve can take on this one here. We go nice and easy. And then move you over here. Do a bit of teamwork. Oh no. I can't take it anymore. I'm sorry, friend. Oh, I forgot what, what voice again. Wasn't the yet voice? I'm sorry, friends. Right back at you. Oh, this is frustrating. 
Alright, so I'm guessing these ones now can't reach. Hmm. Alright. Try and take out one of these. And then have Steve take on this. Probably should have used a weapon attack. But I didn't think. I'm sorry. Go away. Go away. The dodging. Oh no. Come on, Omega. Ninety-five. And how much does the weapon attack do? Eighty-seven. Uh... Well, let's just do it anyway. What's this other one? Stunning pose. Stun adjacent minions. Days adjacent bosses. Hmm. I suppose if. I can get Omega in range. Can also make an attack? Hmm. Alright. So... Omega can get as far as there. Oh, I can't get very far myself. Uh... See, I set up a teamwork, and then oh, he's not going to be able to reach, is he? Oh, just about. Come on, Omega, you can do this. Ah! Oh well. Screw the objectives. Just kill everything in sight. We don't die first. Okay. So we can beat this guy. Oh no, these ones aren't at full health. I can kill this one. There we go. Uh... Oh, multi shot. Need to get in a bit closer in order to use it though. Okay, if I move forward just one, and then that should put all three of them in range. Multi shot. Not great, but at least it did some damage to them. God. Alright, managing to survive somehow. Can I beat any of these? Uh, Omega can kill this one. They are. Pistol. I just move a bit closer, maybe. There we are. Guess I'll try for it. Seventy-five. Kill quite easily with the sword. Nice. Now it's three on three. They don't bother to move, so... Uh, five. Uh, I can't reach 
Oh wait. Lasso. Ah, there we go. Eagle Lasso. And then Teamwork. Omega and I beat the crap out of this one. Nice. And then... Hmm. No, I don't want to risk that. Whoa, who's that guy in the back? What are you doing? <laughs> Get that paparazzo out of here. Okay. Um, stunning pose. Oh, and I get an attack off that as well. Nice. Alright, so I can have Speed kill this one. And we can move in closer. Get off this last one. Just move Omega up here. Uh, just about in range. Yeah. Let's count there by speed. And that should be the fight. Oh, I didn't perform a, a team attack with three squad members. Oh well. Like I say, screw the objectives. We should continue this story in another episode. For now, I'm off to the dentist. Take care, everyone. To be continued. Wait a second. We may use Omega's absence to build a new story piece. Yeah, like Omega was kidnapped by Fat Alien. This will be gold. Well, <laughs> actually, proceeding with the story. We should get to a different position. The audience will think we're at a different part of the episode. Good idea, Speep. Everyone move, and let's get to the new positions. Fat Alien kidnapped Omega when Dorks reached its warehouse so they could get their friend back. Oh, then dogs. Fucking hell. <laughs> and it suddenly appears. You shall never see Omega again. <laughs> uh. Omega's in good hands, dude. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Then, somebody else joins the set using the teleport effect. Who are you? My name is Thomas Dell. I'm a Galax Silver, the sixth ranger of Galax Rangers. We are responsible for maintaining galaxy wide peace. And this intergalactic monster is a threat to us all. What? I thought you were just barging into our studio. But I'll definitely take that. Your line was just too perfect. Welcome to our show, Thomas. Alright, everyone, keep rolling. Galax Silver, it's nice to see you here. Fat alien kidnapped Omega. Say your last words, obese creature. Limitless potential, Galax Silver. Oh, nice. My Galax Saber is ready to strike you down. Defeat all minions before you, before defeating the boss monster. Hit boss every turn. Right. I need to make sure I can attack the boss. Hmm. Alright, let's uh, 
coming up here then. Teamwork. <laughs> Any tactical RPG experts will probably be <laughs> watching this screaming their fucking heads off. I am not a very good <laughs> tactical RPG player. Let's just put it that way. Uh, hit the boss at return. Oh, done for the... Oh, okay, so I don't need to worry about that requirement now. Alright. So, move you here. Double team you. Cool. Deals 150% damage to adjacent target. Yeah, let's just go for it. Galaxaber! Oh, and does 96 damage. Oh well, better than nothing I suppose. Easily kill the turtle. Do some team ups. Take a triple attack. Oh, I need to attack the alien at least once this turn. Ah! You can't do that. Here we go. Oh wait, but didn't it count last time when I tried, when I tried to attack and uh, dodged? Again, I don't pay attention. <laughs> Oh, he only has one hit point left. Okay. Die. Uh... Yeah, we can do a double team on this one, I think. One should be able to get in range. percent I didn't even notice. Oh no, that's annoying. Oh no. And oh fuck. Well looks like I'm not gonna hit that objective either. Teamwork. to attack the Crumbler. Attack with Kevin. You, I need to team up on. Oh, I can't reach. Teamwork. Oh, really? <laughs> For fuck's sake. So I don't need to worry about hitting the alien every time. Oh, really? Okay. All right. Alien gun again. Let's see how far can I get Kevin to move? Not very. Oh, I could have used the. Mm, I'm an idiot. I used the lasso. Uh, no, 
I think we still need another one to join in the attack. And of course, Dave is too out of range in order to do it. I think we need to gang up with everyone before or we can use the finisher. I think anyone's in range anyway, so... Uh, I think I'd want Dave to stay back here. So... Attack with these two. Still not in range to be finished. I'm just going to do a bunch of single attacks. The other one in range. into the fold. Thomas over here. Oh god. That'll be a nightmare. Again, tactical RPG fans be screaming in agony over this, <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Awful. Ah! Uh... <sighs> Alright. Stop doing this! Why don't I use our flashy finisher attack on you? Don't do that if you keep walking away. Uh, Alright. Alright, let's see if we can finish this off. Uh, Stand together, dorks. <laughs> Triple attack! No! <laughs> Damn it. Oh no. Oh, I thought... I thought was gonna aim at Dave. Ooh. Can we do our finisher? Taste the pain bow! Oh wait. <laughs> because uh, because I make us go and we can actually use our actual special attack. Uh, ugh, you have bested me! This spread was easy to handle, dorks. Thanks for your help, Galax Silver. No need to thank me. You should thank the energized crystals we all channel Galaxia Force from. But I must leave now. My ship, the Star Road Surfer, awaits me. I bid you good luck in your path, dorks. We need more friends like this one. Yeah, I can't wait for Omega to watch this episode. Smile. Or colon D, rather. Smile is something different. Oh, thank god, not 69 this time. My job at work tomorrow will be to tell everyone about dorks. I was enjoying dorks up to the point 
that good wins in the end. Hashtag evil minions, hashtag team monsters. You're watching Super Sentai for the whole wrong reasons there, mate. Uh, as always, watching dorks, I burned my meal completely, yay for me. <laughs> really? They're training Kung Fu for a long time and they still get hurt by those monsters? Hey, it's hard. Marketing, Dave, mad folks. Hmm. Of this one, uh, three episodes for hundred and twelve. Yeah, why not? Oh, fan power? Like... Ah, see, yeah. Plus 100 starting audience. Handy. Ten plus per episode. Or income conversion rate. Um, don't know. Not too fussed about the income at the moment because I'm kind of saving up the money. Uh, outdoor advertising. That might be useful, so let's go with that. Oh, Always. What's this email? Be careful, you're in danger. This is boring. Delete. I cross anything new? No. No, okay. Hardboard sword. I don't want to see how much better this would be compared to what they already have. Uh, no, nah, nah. That's not that great. Clay gun. How about this for the ones who have the, the ranged weapons? Skill regen, not great, no. Um, the dodge is good though? Hmm. I'll think about that one. Alright, <clears throat> on to the next episode. Oh, the season finale. An odd figure wanders through the streets of Dork City. What is it planning? Dorks will find out and use a new invention from Cerebro to put an end to it. <gasps> Ooh. You're gonna see a giant robot fight? <clears throat> the mysterious visit. <clears throat> the mysterious villain, Tran Transit Mancer. Finally got it right this time. Was spotted downtown. Is that Bulb and Skull in the background there? <laughs> it was about to enter the science lab when dorks appeared. Hey, Transit Man- uh, Hey, Transit Mancer! Stop! You're not shining our lights on that research data- You're not shining your lights on that research data! I can't fucking read. How did you know I was on my way to the lab? You don't exactly blend in with that terrible outfit. And since you failed last time, we figured you were trying to steal the pro project again. I'd say I'd stay in front of that lab door day and night if I had to. I'd give you a ticket for illegal parking, Kevin. Minions. God. Oh, look at the doggo. <laughs> 
We are here to aid you, master! Before we go here, standing, damage the boss, monster on the first turn. Okay. So I need to get somebody in range to attack Transit Monster. There's Phoebe, you got there. Oh, really? Okay, Kevin. Alright. Now attack the Transit Monster. There we go. And we can nerd up. Nerd up. Everybody say, when you hear the call, you've got to get it underway. Nerd up. God. Oh, I could have used the multi, multi shot. Didn't think. I'm an idiot. What else is new? Side of this teamwork. Finally, have Kevin do an attack. Hmm. Teamwork. Eh, you know what? Let's let's use the uh, the multi shot. Team this one. Nice. Oh no. Alright. No. Oh, Take this one. Nice. Kevin could kill this one. Maybe we can do a double team? There we go. Oh, there was still a minion left. I didn't... <laughs> didn't notice. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Speed can take this one out. These guys getting up on the, the transit monster. Got triple attack. What about this? This one transit monster had more attacks. Fantastic quadruple. Don't get too cocky, dorks. I have a little surprise for you. Did you think my master would let me handle that data? Uh, wait, what? I was only intended as a distraction to keep you from getting in his way. No way! We will defeat you in time to keep him away from the lab. In time, you'd better hit those brakes be because I'm out. But how? Where did it go now? My scans indicate that the creature vanished completely. Cerebro might have led for us. Might have a lead for us, rather. <laughs> Wait, not so fast. We need more action in this part, Omega. All mud men to the scene. Haha, <laughs> Omega, you're, you were really pulled into the story. Don't forget about our audience. Are you looking for an excuse to, ex to escape the fight, dorks? Winky face. 
Win in four turns, execute five team attacks. Duck. One. Let's do a triple on this one. Triple attack. Ah. Uh. Well, back to where you came from. Team attacks. Uh, I need a, a third. To, oh, God. Why am I like this? Fantastic quadruple. I'm sorry, friends. Oh god. Dave's out already? Team attacks. Hmm. No. All right. Uh. Might be able to finish this one off. Maybe. Oh. Okay. Got high roll. That was good. Teamwork on this one, and that's that. But I don't think we're going to be able to beat this stage in the next turn. Win in three out of four turns. So, I think we should have another turn after this one then? Sword attack. Well, at least that's one of those dealt with. Uh, we need to finish off that bread crumbler, really. I use lasso here. I can move that one closer to us. And then teamwork. And we can team up on this one. Oh, we got a cardboard box. Nice. Alright, so we still want another turn to finish this off. No, I, uh, yeah, I don't see it happening. Uh, okay. We let that objective slip. Uh, at least I didn't get too many casualties this time around. to Cerebro's Chambers now!
And then Dorks went to visit Cerebro. Alright everyone, teleport in now. After a long talk with Cerebro. So what should we do? The research is probably in their hands by now. I have developed a machine to help you in this matter. I could not find a suitable name, so I called it... Dorkatron. <laughs> uh, why am I like this? May it act in your hands as an instrument to bring peace to this world. And I assume there will be no time for testing it since a dangerous situation may happen at any moment, right? Beep, beep, beep. Precisely, Dave. Dorks, the alarm is sounding. You must go now. Scans indicate that the monster has returned to the location where you last met. If in trouble, remember to make use of your new device. Got it, Cerebro. A few seconds earlier, a traffic cone wearing creature teleported to the same scene. But our heroes arrived just in time. Ha! Did you miss me while I was gone? Not really. You were right there sitting in front of that actor chair. Haha. <laughs> Come on. That's anticlimactic. I even forgot my line after this one. Is it time for a Dorkatron? Not yet. We should have another fight before that happens. Oh, right. I got it. We are sending you back home at full speed, villain. This is definitely some breaking news. Eat six enemies, defeat boss monster with a finishing move. Alright. I'm gonna try and play it a bit safer this time around, only move them a few spaces at a time. Uh, right. yeah. Oh, there's another dog there. That's kind of Flipping through the... <laughs> um... What the... <laughs> your dog, you're kind of clipping through the border there. Uh... <laughs> Jeez. Green light! Oh god, he teleports now. Defeat six enemies, so I'm guessing others will pop up later on. Okay, that dog is still there. That one... Oh, that's gonna annoy the hell out of me. <laughs> oh. Alright. Uh... Try and chip away at it. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm just gonna use the... Ooh. Uh... Is that only a one-time thing? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna save it until the end. Hopefully, I can keep all of the team intact. All right. Next time, don't be evil. Oh, here comes more minions. Green light. So let's uh. These off. I might need one more to kill that one. Triple attack. Nice. Yellow light. Races attack on that one. Um, right, does anyone need healing?
I've got to, I, I've just seen my health. 69 me done! 69 me saved me! <laughs> uh, oh well. But the healer is the one that's at the, in the worst state at the moment. Um, move you back. Um, uh, the healing ability doesn't work on the healer itself. That sucks. Okay. Alright, so... Sveeb, Kevin, and Omega are still at 100% health, so they should be fine to deal a bit more damage. I'll stay back with Dave. And these three can team up. Dave's at 32% now? Can, can the clerics really not heal themselves? Let's see. Heal Doken. Oh. Oh, he can use it on himself. Okay. Heal Doken! Nice. Uh, Alright. It's the Veeb. There. Kevin's Veeb can take this one out. I reach anyone with my lasso? Probably not. No. Okay. Am I going to reach anyone with his weapons? No. Okay, so teamwork. God, please. Kill anyone. Let me dodge this green light! And he just went to the same spot he was in before. What a waste of an ability. Alright, so... Dave's health is back up. Heaven looks in pretty rough shape. I'm not doing too well myself, so... Hmm... I'll move here. That teamwork, and then have Dave up here. I think Kevin should be in range for the uh, for the team heal. Okay. Didn't heal a lot, but certainly enough. Sveeb down here. Sveeb and Omega? No, no, okay. Has to be Sveeb and Kevin. No! Ah, that's annoying. Alright, Omega. Multi shoot. Yeah, that did a little bit at least. Oh no, don't attack me. Alright. Uh, need to kill three more minions. We can take this one out. And Kevin can kill this one. Sure, I'm close to Dave. Omega could probably go for an attack. And then Dave down here. There we are. Red light. Oh no, not the stun. Okay, 
That's fine though, because uh, need to beat one more enemy apparently before we can do the special. Let's just gang off on him for a bit. Oh, that probably wasn't a good idea because Evan's not doing very well. Uh, maybe move Dave up there. Give Kevin a heal token. Oh. Well, the teamwork should heal enough. Green light. Oh no, not Dave. Certainly another wave of enemies should have appeared should have appeared by now. Alright. Anyone who still has a decent amount of life left can go in for an attack. Uh, Evan, I will keep back. Me, I should probably up here. Omega can attack. Can use heal Doken again, so I think Dave might need it on himself actually. <laughs> okay, uh I Dave back a bit. Not on that, because uh, turns out Marta can uh, teleport anywhere he wants. Heal Dokken! Yellow light! Oh no, increasing his attack power. Where are the other enemies? Unless, unless Transit Monster counts as the final enemy. Right, I've not seen the, the prompt to say we can finish him yet, so probably just gang off on him a bit more. Uh, Kevin on standby. Probably step back a bit. Mega can attack. And Dave will just teamwork. Passive healing ability. Green light! Great use of your ability there. You could have just walked there, you know. Uh, let's see. Two turns left until I can use another heal token. Sveeb is at 50% health, so probably keep him back a bit. Kevin's at 68. Yeah, it's teamwork. I'm at 65. That's not ideal. Back. Might as well just move everyone back, just so they can get a bit of heal. Go. Green light! Alright, still no prompt for the finisher. Still can't heal Doken yet, but... Everyone's at decent health, so probably do a bit more chipping. This is so fun! Ah, oh, there we go. Liked that! Alright, so let's just have everyone else teamwork this turn. Oh god! Ah, oh, just when I thought we were in a. Good spot. Alright. 
Kevin's low on health, so probably get him in range of a heal token. That'll do. Heal token! Alright, uh, Zvib. Can't reach anyone, so just teamwork. Just trying to keep everyone together and do teamworks. Mm. I'll try and go for a multi shoot. Probably not going to be able to reach if I do that, so. Yeah, I'll just teamwork this turn. Green light. Uh, yeah, kind of want to try and finish the objective, so... Teamwork. Steve and Kevin finish that off. The enemy's objective is complete. We'll just round up everyone for teamworks. Teamwork. Teamwork. God. Green light! Hopefully everyone's in range. I think we got it. Alright, Transit Monster. It's time to taste the pain bow! monster with a finishing move. Ouch! Getting kicked twice in the same episode! So not cool! Sorry for that elbow in the face. It was... it was the heat of the moment. You know you can't beat me like this. I'll be back stronger and bigger! Wait, what? What does that mean, Omega? It's simple. You cannot defeat me! <laughs> they call it a second life, but how is this possible? Tremble, mortals! My light shall burn you down! The time has come! I'm ready, my master! Make me! Imagination! Oh wait, imagination! What is that, one of Cerebro's inventions? It certainly is, and we are ready to roll. You are lucky to have Cerebro on your side this time. What do you mean by this time? Cerebro ha was never on your side. Don't turn red because I'm about to change. Red, green, yellow, the color, the power of RGY will strike you down. God. Imagination. Form Dorkatron! Beautiful. Time for a giant robot fight. Okay. Uh, beat monster with final strike, execute four perfect attacks. Okay. Let's hope I remember how to do this. Nice. Ah, missed it. Okay. Let's make sure we get the time right for these. Yeah, it's been ages since I've done this. Oh. Okay, so that's one bar down. Oh, 
I've done enough perfect. Oh. Beat monster with final strike. Alright, we've activated our special skill. Oh. Uh. Uh. Oh, okay. Oh, thank god. I thought the, f the game had crashed on me for a minute there. <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, so... 8640. Try and knock myself down then. One more of them. And. Sword Strike. Justice will overcome! I think that's the phrase they say in the Power Rangers fighting game. I don't know. How long until more of these things come down to Earth? Who knows? At least our planet is saved for the moment. I don't know how, but we did it! And we did it so well! We managed to learn how to pilot the Dorkatron in the heat of the moment! It was great indeed! We just need to learn how to make some cooler moves for the next battle! Whatever happens, I am ready for it. Who would have thought the Dorkatron would be so easy to control? Why does Dave not get any lines? Here we go. We should touch base about the things that happened in the last few weeks. What about that message we got from Dr. Soap? He was offering a deal. Pay him or go to court. As if we had taken his ideas and reused them in our series. And what did you tell him, Rob? I told him we'd give him some money. Yeah, it's better this way. At least he'll stop bothering us. Let's hope he doesn't show up here like he did in that party we had. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Well, moving on to the next topic. Good news. Thanks for our hard work. We have now... We now have a nice fan base and a growing community. Now that things are going well, we need to focus on reaching even higher audience levels. We need some threat to Cerebral on the next season. Soon enough, we'll have our first episode of the second season. Let's get to work. Dorks is here to stay, but things won't stay simple for long. Hey, you, watchdogs. Oh my god, at Garrido. You have surpassed all my expectations with your show. This was perfect, starry eyes. Hashtag dorks. As I was watching dorks, I burned my meal completely. Yay for me. God. You need to stop burning your meals, dude. Alright, season performance, excellent. This is the best thing ever, but people's expectations for the next season are high. Alright, let's just check some things out before I, uh, before I wrap this stream up. Oh, what's this? What's up, Garrido? We just wanted to drop you a quick line saying how much we at Henshin Justice Unlimited love your show. We would consider it a great privilege to interview your cast and crew. If you'd like to see what we do at... H-J-U, H -J -U. check us out at henshinjustice.com. You might even tr try it outside the game. Take care, and henshin on. Isn't henshin justice an actual, like, community? I swear I've seen that name somewhere. <coughs> God. Thanks for allowing us the chance to talk with your cast and crew. What you'd like to know, since posting the interview, our page views increased tenfold. It seems it seems people really love dorks. Thank you again and henchin on. A great justice, the HGU team. J J U team, fucking hell. Fans has increased plus ten. A message from Jupiter. 
Hey friends, it's Takeda from Cyber Police. I'm ready to congratulate you, Garrido. You are doing such a great job, and I really hope you can record something together sometime. Dorks is amazing. Oh, I almost forgot. Tomoko sent to hug her Venus armor that you signed. Turned out really good, but we crafted it too late for our season finale. Uh, hearing from you is super inspiring. I'm glad to hear it. We need more amazing shows like yours. I'll spread the word about it for everyone I know from the Sentai industry. Take care. Ooh, more fans. Mark it in. We have more fan power. You can put into income conversion rate. Uh, let's see. Oh, we can craft new stuff. Awesome. Let's see, can we recycle some bits? Let's recycle these. Materials. This um, new garage made suit plus 52 health and random properties. Cool. Let's see who can benefit from this most. I think Dave definitely needs the health. Let's give him this. Equip. There we go. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> uh, let's see. Helmets. No. What do we need for this? Uh, what is that? Gouache paint. Uh, oh, I can't craft it, apparently. No. I could buy some packs, though. Yeah. Oh, could I really not get any ink? Okay. That's fine. Craft some more leather, though. didn't need that much leather, I think, but... Oh well, let's just, uh... Use these materials anyway. Carriage me suit. Hmm. Guess I benefit the most from this one, so... Equip. Gen. Really haven't used haven't used Kevin's skills all that much, so maybe Kevin. Yeah, we can always use lever for the for the evil rival girl, so yeah, yeah. Very uh, Regen. I don't know, I don't know. Uh, uh, give it to Steve. Mm, recycle these. Oh wow, what, one of them is still rocking an impro improvised suit. <laughs> Ooh, all right. Craft one more of these. Yeah. A little more of 
more or less the same. Um, let's give this one to, an, to Omega. Why not? Check out the mech. Oh yeah, we can uh, customize parts of it, I guess. Uh, make a chest. <laughs> Obviously, I can't any of those. Um, well, I kind of want a dragon head, but of course, I can't make one yet. <laughs> I do like my dargons. Cardboard or justice, nothing to do with Amazon cardboard boxes. These ones won't break as easily. <laughs> true, true. Mm. Really want the dog in the head. Okay. Uh, maybe I'll think about that one. Punch arm, sword arm. I do like the sword being a finisher, so maybe I'll stick with that one. Uh, legs. Include space for extra duct tape and glue for emergencies. <laughs> of course. Uh, armored legs. Wonder boots. And make after enemy knockdown. Don't know what I want to do here. Um, I suppose just upgrade the basic stuff and then think about moving on to other things later on, perhaps. equipment. I can't customize anything else quite yet. Oh wait, did I? Did I get a new technique? Oh, the right arm. Oh, right. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, of course I can, uh, can change up some of my... Giraffe's Apprentice. Deal 30 damage. 30% 30 damage. Uh, heal 15% hit points. Does that only work for me? I I'm guessing that only works for me then. Gain 20 plus audience for Team Acrobat and... Um, I'm guessing that's a passive skill, so, yeah. Uh, must be a passive. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do with you? Uh, square house kick. Or might you salt. Yeah, stick with the square house kick. Wait, square? Oh, yeah, I, I get it. <laughs> that took me a while, but yeah. Let's see. Uh, dexterity, gain 20% dodge, and plus 3 audience for each tile. Tile you move, ability you gain to move. Uh, I'm fine with dexterity, I think. What about Dave? Oh, energy res No, no, I, I want to keep the heal token. All but so Heals all enemies up to four tiles of what- Maybe I can. Maybe I should get rid of heal token for- Gain plus 15 skill regen. Yeah, maybe I could get away with- Yeah, because- Circle of Friendship is pretty much just a superpower version of Heal Dogen, so yeah. Swap over skills. Uh, gain skill regen every time you attack. Alright, and then 
and what about Omega? Multi shot, find weakness. Target up to four moles, four tile, four. <laughs> fucking hell. Target up to four tiles away takes 30% more damage for three turns. Hmm. Sniper Cat gain plus 8% damage for each tile distance your target. Attack, teleport. Teleport yourself to any free position. Up to Teleport might be useful. I'll give him teleport. Uh, and then I think I'll stick with these ability. Giraffe's apprentice though. I, I really don't. Yeah, let's go with giraffe's apprentice because I don't have any. Oh uh... well, no, it's a lie. I have the the sword ability, but I guess more range would be a good idea. Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, is there anything else I can get from the shop? Oh, we have some uh, specialized weapons here. Mm, Avenger broom. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, can't I craft Japanese toy dagger? Is that like the dragon dagger? That's another series, but no one will notice it, right? <laughs> uh, nice. <laughs> uh, uh, roll can't equip this type of item. Oh wait, yeah, because it's yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll equip this one to Dave. Uh, that's Steve. Avenger Broom. <laughs> Truly a weapon to be reckoned with. Give myself that then. Give Kevin the plastic sword. doesn't offer much in the way of skill regen. Uh, we'll see how we get on with that. I'll do. Oh. Um, yeah, but no. Uh, I'd say Omega is more of a ranged attacker, so... Recycle some of the stuff we're not using. And I think that'll do. Right. Reach season two now, so I think that's probably where I'm gonna leave off. It is quarter past midnight now. So yeah, should probably start wrapping up. Uh, yeah, that was a fun little session. I yeah, I quite enjoyed this game. <laughs> I haven't played it in since really since it came out like five years ago, I think it was. <laughs> but yeah, no, quite fun, and uh, looking forward to playing this again soon. I'm hoping the the audio and everything was all right. I don't know if it was just an issue with the PlayStation stuff. I did get a new PS2 to replace the one that I was using, so... I'm hoping that that was what was causing the audio issues, because the PS1, the, the PS2 rather, that I was using before, uh, it wasn't in the best shape when I bought it, to be fair. <laughs> so, yeah. Hopefully, if I'm doing WWF Smackdown tomorrow night, um... Hopefully it will the the audio quality will be better. Hoping so anyway. But yeah, uh that'll do for the night session. Sorry again, I've been tripping over myself. I I'm a bit out of practice with streaming. The internet issues over the last month or so haven't helped much. 
<laughs> so yeah, I'm a bit kind of all over the place with everything, but I'm hoping now I can get back into a proper routine so I can stop being so like awkward and shit. <laughs> it just seems like we've gone back to square one in terms of my commentary sort of stuff because I barely said anything outside of like talking about the game, obviously. I want to be able to talk about more stuff. It's just, yeah, my nerves are completely shot when I'm trying to stream. So sometimes I struggle to get things out. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm hoping you enjoyed. Um, I'm probably going to be staying up to watch the uh, some of the Digimon Con stuff, probably up until around two o'clock because really all I'm fussed about is the video game stuff. Maybe I'll stick around for the, what was it, the card game stuff as well. But yeah. I am <laughs> manifesting the uh, Digimon Classic Collection. We need these games on, a, on modern consoles. No more bloody import fees. No, not import, like secondhand stuff. You know. <laughs> this is the age of uh, remastered ports, we're hoping. The Digimon World series will get some. But yeah. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. <laughs> and uh I'll hopefully I'll see you tomorrow night for the WWF SmackDown. We'll see. Anyways, take care everyone. Good night.